special newscast today on Channel 75 News. We're hearing from an expert ornithologist in the Himalayas. This is one of the most unique birds we've ever seen. It almost resembles a hawk slash a pelican. It has long, it has long, strong legs that we think it uses to grab Himalayan marmots out of holes. It also uses talons to grip onto the ground when it's very windy on the Himalayas. It, it was one of the smartest birds in the world. It may even be the smartest. It uses its beak to stab its prey, and then it's already learned to how to start fires. It, it, hangs, it hangs its prey onto the fire with its beak. Thank you. Wow, that is fascinating. I've never heard of a bird so smart to start fires. Let's throw it back out to Mr. Donahue, the expert ornithologist in the Himalayas, to hear more news about how the bird starts fires. Yes, it is it's a very fascinating bird. We believe it learned how to start fire somewhere about a month ago in the in the Siberian forests. I think it uses its legs to to pick up rocks and then it uses its beak to like scrape and start sparks. And it also has another bird that helps it pick up sticks around. It's a very 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 intelligent bird. Wow, that is fascinating news, Mr. Donahue. Thank you so much for your time. And we actually have just gotten word that a Mount Everest climber has been attacked by a bird. Not many birds live up there, so it could be our special creature. Thank you. See you next time on News 75. Now another special newscast with Mr. Donahue about the newly named Himalayan chickadee. Yes, today I have finally spotted the elusive bird. As you can see here, this is a replica of the Himalayan chickadee. I have also found the breakthrough discovery. I believe this bird was once a black cap chickadee. It, re it resembles a black cap chickadee because of its black cap. Here you can see a normal black cap chickadee. Wow, that is amazing, Mr. Donahue. I believe we have some footage of the Himalayan chickadee making its journey to the Himalayas. I believe this bird has a disorder that helped it so much with its journey. His disorder is that he adapts his body parts in nights instead of thousands of years. It is truly amazing. Wow, truly amazing news, Mr. Donahue. Thank you for tuning in to Channel 75 News.